What is up, guys? I'm Zaf. I'm Rob. I'm Bryce. And this is Real Time. Today, we're coming back at you with another movie night. This is number 49, The Proposal. I haven't seen this movie. I know that is a really good movie, though, because the most gorgeous guy ever is in this movie, Ryan Reynolds, and the most one of the most gorgeous girls ever, Sandra Bullock. I think it's going to be a romance comedy. <laughs> I know it's going to be. You guys voted for a comedy, <laughs> so I'd hope so. So I'm really excited. I love the, the romance and the comedy mixes. They're some of the most interesting things to watch it even makes it more funny i think when there's romance in a comedy so i'm super excited to see these uh master class actors in in work yeah i've also never watched this like everything else i think this is the first time we've had both these two actors that stuff was talking about on the channel sandra bullock and ryan reynolds both definitely like he said great actors very excited to see i don't know i so in some of these movies like i'm like I, I can't even see these people as like playing a couple yeah. like this is one of them i don't really like i can't really see it when i think of sandra bullock i think of the blind side when i think of freaking <laughs> ryan reynolds i think of funny deadpool but yeah i i have seen this movie it's been a very very long time i i remember watching this like a bunch as a kid it was one of those movies that like would just kind of have on in the background like on repeat I, I honestly don't remember a whole lot right now but i already know it's going to be like one of those movies that it's all going to come back to me once yeah. i start watching it i already have like a feeling in my brain i feel like part of this movie is in alaska some for some reason and um, i i also have a feeling that there might be a proposal this movie yeah. that's a good chance of happening i think I've, this is also very fitting because zuff actually did just have a proposal recently so everyone clap it up congratulate him in the comments below go follow his instagram <laughs> that good to go in yeah all right, guys, with all that being said, we're going to go right into this movie. If you guys do like our videos, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. We are so close to 100,000, so if you could knock out that subscriber button, we would be absolutely pleased. Um, check out our links in the description. We got the Patreon, the Discord, and our social medias. Make sure you follow all of those and send us some stuff to the address at the very bottom of the description. That is our P.O. box. We do mail time on the channel, so make sure you check that out. And yeah, we're going to go into movie night Number 49, the romance comedy, The Proposal. Let's do it. Is that Sandra? Yeah. Are we on a bike? Stationary bike. She's pretty. God, do I miss 2000, 2000s movies intros, intros like this. Yeah. There he is. He's My just goodness. like a nice guy. Good looking man. You think he's better looking than uh, Ryan Gosling? No, uh, I don't know. That's tough, but I have to give it to Gosling. He's Dude, the better Ryan. I swear, every time I see like a, people ask guys, like, who, like name a good looking guy, they're, they always say Ryan Reynolds. Yeah. It's like the yeah. I mean, he is a good looking guy, guy. Guy to go to. He is a good looking man. I'm Team Gosling though. I, would I say, think I am too. I think I'm Reynolds. Let us know in the comments, guys. Are you Team Ryan Reynolds uh, or Team know. Ryan Gosling? Ryan Reynolds, Ryan Gosling, or Zuff? Three rank, rank the three in the comments. Literally saved my life. Thank you. Mm. Oh, she likes him. Mm. I think everybody likes him. Does he have Riz? Okay. <laughs> it's W. I feel like we're watching Devil Wears Prada. This is New York. Yeah. Oh, damn. That looked like it hurt. Elevators scare me. Fun fact. Really? Yeah. Not too fun of a fact. I Claustrophobic. I like, I don't mind elevators, but I can't ride a plane. He works for a book publishing Captain company. Obvious. One of those mornings. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Oh. He is a clumsy guy. And there goes one of his copies. All over the mail. Yankees, Boston, this Tuesday, two company seats for your shirt. You have five seconds to decide. Five, four, <laughs> he needs a new shirt. Five uh -oh. This is like Devil Wears Prada, like someone walked like corporate, yeah, yeah. yeah. corporate business. It's, it's... Oh no, she's the boss. I think they all look scared of her. Cancel the call, push the meeting to tomorrow, and keep the lawyer on the sheets. Oh, and get a hold I'm of God, and Does this not feel like Devil? Frank is doing. Same Oprah. exact vibe so far. It's just like corporate America in New York vibes. Boss, yeah. assistant. Who is uh? Who is Jillian? Why does she want me to call her? Oh, <laughs> the barista at Starbucks. Well, that was originally my cup. And I'm drinking your coffee. Why? Because your coffee spilled. 
Uh oh. Does she like his <laughs> his order? You drink unsweetened cinnamon light soy lattes. <laughs> I do. Mm. It's like Christmas in a cup. <laughs> is that a coincidence? Incredibly, it is. Oh, uh, it's just <laughs> the same, same order. order. That's smart, dude. I don't like it. <laughs> the witch is on her broom. Everyone act cool. She's coming. <laughs> At least he's giving everybody a heads up. Yeah. Can I say something? No. I've, I've read thousands of manuscripts. This is the only one I've ever. Did she say no? Incredible yeah. novel in there. The kind of novel you used to publish. Ah. Uh. <laughs> ah. Our fearless leader. Is that Sandra Bullock? Yes. What? You've been, you haven't realized that this whole time? <laughs> you said she was one of the most beautiful what? women ever in the intro. Bob, I'm letting you go. Wow. Oh my god, dude. This is brutal. I will give you two months to find another job. Actually, a lot of time. When you resign. That, I mean, yeah, that actually is a lot of time. Two months? What's his 20? He's moving? He has crazy eyes. <laughs> Uh-oh, he's oh, coming, he's no. coming. <laughs> okay, well, there goes your two months, bro. Oh, no. You, you don't think I see what you're doing here? Sandbagging me on this Oprah thing just so that you can look good to the board? Because you are threatened by me. And you are a monster. Bob is embarrassing himself right now. <laughs> I didn't fire you because I feel threatened. No, I fired you because you're lazy, entitled, incompetent, and you spend more time cheating on your wife than you do in your office. Wow. <laughs> Damn. She just, uh, she got him back. She got him back. Yeah, that was a good comeback for okay, sure. We'll film it with this little camera phone, and then we'll put it on that internet site. What was it? YouTube. Exactly. <laughs> Is that what you want? Never heard of that one. That internet site. Oh my gosh. I need you around this weekend to help review his files and his manuscript. This weekend? You have a problem with that? No, I just, I, I just my grandmother's 90th birthday, so I, I was going to go home, and it, it's fine. I'll cancel. Yeah, no, no, I'll be here. Yeah. She'll have another yeah, one, probably. She'll have another 90th birthday, yep. I know, I know. Gammy, I'm Gammy. sorry. Okay, what you... I'd be Gammy's gonna be so disappointed, dude. I've worked too hard for this promotion to throw it all away, okay? I'm sure the dad is pissed. But we take all of our submissions around here. Very <laughs> great transition there. Is that your family? Yes. <laughs> Every single day. Miss Tate's office. Good morning, Miss Tate. <laughs> <laughs> bro. She's so mean, bro. Margaret, do you remember when we agreed that you wouldn't go to the Frankfurt Book Fair because you weren't allowed out of the country while your visa application was being processed? Yes, I did. And you went to Frankfurt? Yes, I did. Your visa application has been denied. Well, that, that... And you are being deported. Oh, to where? Come on. Jeez, bro. Come on. It's, it's not like I'm even an immigrant. You're an immigrant? I'm from Canada, for Christ's sake. Oh, she's from sake. Canada. Oh, uh, we're going to Alaska. You have to leave the country for at least a year. Wow. If you're deported, you can't work for an American company. Until this is resolved, I'm going to turn operations over to Bob's father. No, Bob's fired. If he's the only person in the building who has enough experience. You cannot be serious. I beg of Margaret, you. I beg we are desperate to have you stay. <sighs> she just fired Bob, and now Bob's about to get her job. Mary from Ms. Winfrey's office called. She's on the line. I know. She's on hold. She needs to speak to me right know, away. I but I told you you were otherwise engaged. So... Oh, she just got an idea in her head. Get that green card, girl. A proposal. Yeah. He's plotting, for sure. He looks so confused. Come here right now. This is my man. <laughs> it makes more sense now while they're together. I think there's something that you should know. Uh, we're, uh, we're getting married. <laughs> we are getting married. Us two. You and I are getting married. Yes. We are. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't he your secretary? Wouldn't be the first time one of us fell for our secretaries, would it, Edwin? Nope. <laughs> you know, Andrew and I were, we are uh, just two people who weren't meant to fall in love, but we did. We no. Did. <laughs> Weekend book fairs, you know. No. <laughs> 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 All I can say is no. Can't can't fight a can't can't fight a can't fight a love like ours. 
<laughs> you Do see that half kiss. Yeah. He's a <laughs> Just make it legal. Hmm? Oh. Yeah, well then then uh that that means uh we <laughs> Look at him, bro. He hasn't like changed expressions. <laughs> So let's talk. What are, what's going on here? I don't understand what's happening. <laughs> oh, relax. This is for you too. Do explain. They were going to make Bob chief. So naturally, I would have to marry you. <laughs> Makes complete sense. I'm not going to marry you. Sure you are. Because if you don't marry me, your dreams of touching the lives of millions with the written word are dead. Oh, that's so mean, dude. You're going to threaten his career if he doesn't marry you? What, is he an author? I guess. I don't know. But don't worry, after the required allotment of time, we'll get a quickie divorce and be done with me. But until then, like it or not, your wagon is hitched to mine. Okay? Oh, oh God. <laughs> Dude, it looks like his world just ended. Ryan Reynolds. What's his name in this? Drew. Andrew. So, I have one question for you. What's that? Are you both committing fraud do, 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 do. to avoid her deportation? <laughs> oh, oh getting gosh. right to it. Editor-in-chief at Colden Books. Getting right to it. Put you each in a room, and I'll ask you every little question that a real couple would know about each other. Goodness, uh, dude. I dig deeper. I look at your phone records. I talk to your neighbors. I interview your coworkers. Wow, they would not pass that. You think they really do this? Mm, maybe if they think you're committing fraud. Fine of two hundred and fifty thousand dollars and a stay of what? five years in federal prison. Oh, oh my, Andrew, you wanna you wanna talk to me? No. <laughs> Nothing to say, man. Getting married. Margaret and I are madly in love. Are just two people madly in love. Weren't supposed to fall in love. Same thing she said. <laughs> we couldn't tell anyone we worked with because of my my big promotion that I had coming up. Promotion? Oh. Oh yeah. We both felt uh, that it would be uh, deeply inappropriate if I were to be promoted to editor. Editor. While we were. <laughs> this dude's getting his too. Oh yeah, you have to, bro. Gotta be even. You told your parents about your secret love? Oh, nope. I, uh, uh, impossible. My parents are dead. <laughs> no brothers or sisters either. So. Gone. 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 Oh, no, his are, his no. are very much alive. Gammy's 90th era. birthday this oh, weekend. You're gonna tell them this weekend. Gammy's 90th birthday. My whole family's coming together. Ah. Oh. And where is this surprise gonna take place? At, uh, Andrew's parents' house. Where, where, where's that located again? Why don't you tell them where it is? Jump in. <laughs> Sitka. Sitka. Alaska. 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 I knew it had something to do with Alaska. I see how this is going to go. Gilbertson's on to you. 11 o'clock Monday morning for your scheduled interview. They're going to end up falling in love. Right? Yeah, for sure. Forced me to eat this clammy, warm, creamy salad thing, which was, hey, I'm s why aren't you taking notes? I'm sorry. Were you not in that room? <laughs> yeah. Did you hear what he said? Promote you to editor? Then I quit, and you're screwed. Bye-bye, Margaret. Andrew. It really has been a little slice what? of Andrew! Heaven. Andrew! Fine! Fine. Oh? Why can't you just, just make, give him the promotion, bro? Why is it such a big deal? And you'll publish my manuscript. Mm. 20,000 copies, first run. And we'll tell my family about our engagement when I want and how I want. Now, ask me nicely. <laughs> the roles have reversed. He has all the power now. He has to propose to him. What does that mean? You heard me. On your knee. Ooh, I like this. Take in charge. <laughs> wow. Uh, does, does this work for you? Oh, I like good? this, yeah. Okay, good. Uh, will you marry me? No. <laughs> Andrew? Yes, Margaret. Sweet. Andrew? This has to be so satisfying <laughs> to do to your boss. Okay, I don't appreciate the sarcasm, but I'll do it. See you at the airport tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Going to Alaska. I knew it. How do you know? I knew it. These are the questions that INS is going to ask us. Now, 
good news is, is I know everything about you, but the bad news is that you have four days to learn all this about me. That's true. He d probably d does know every single thing about her. Cause yeah, he's, he's her follower. assistant. I'm pretty sure that you have a tattoo. Oh, you're, uh, you're pretty sure? I'm pretty sure. Two years ago, your dermatologist called and asked about a Q-switch laser. I, of course, Googled a Q-switch laser and found that they, in fact, do remove, remove tattoos. Really good memory. He knows everything, bro. Did you know? I thought we were going to Sitka. We are. Well, how are we getting to Sitka? They're in a different plane. Yeah. Oh. What's that? Sitka, Sitka, Sitka Skyways. Skyways. You probably have to fly into Alaska and yeah. then fly into the other town. Sitka. Alaska or Hawaii, where are you going? Oh, oh yeah, his grandma's Betty White, isn't it? I forgot. Yeah. Oh my R.I.P. Betty White, man. Rest in peace to Betty White. Where's Dad? Oh, you know your father. He's always working. Oh, I know. Is that the, is that the mom yeah, from Step Brothers? Yeah. 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 She's from a lot of things. Uh, Margaret's my mom. Oh, hello. <laughs> no hugs. Hello. Hello there. Now, do you prefer being called Margaret? Or Satan's mistress. Oh my we've God. Heard it both ways. <laughs> <laughs> Satan's mistress. That's super typical, like grandparents just not having a filter. Mm. Just, yeah. Aw, <laughs> they're so close. She's gonna fall for this dude. In Alaska. In Sitka. I mean, it's probably unastonishing there. Unastonishing? Yeah. So not astonishing. Words, man. Astonishing. Paxton, Paxton. Everything. everything is Paxton. What's his last name? Paxton. They own the town, bro. Oh, <laughs> what was that noise? Oh, ah. Businesses, honey. He's probably just being modest, dear. Yeah, she was chirping him. Look her, how her, beautiful like, saying this he place probably doesn't is. have any money. They probably have so much money. They own this whole town, like. <laughs> All the businesses. Didn't we check into our hotel right now? Oh, we canceled your reservation. Family doesn't stay at a hotel. You're gonna stay in our home. <laughs> Just not what she wanted at all. This is the last of them. Oh my gosh. No. Oh, five second rule. Got it. He's being such a dickhead. The Louis Vuitton bag into the lake. No, I can't swim. It's the boat. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's why we're getting in a boat. He's gonna fall down that thing. He's gonna catch her, bro. Stuff ant. Yeah, I mean, it would be a good catch. Just gonna give me a little hand here. <laughs> Ooh. Off ass. Off ass. Oh, jeez. <laughs> They're gonna have a nice ass house. On the on the lake? Dude, oh, this yeah. place is beautiful. We have to go to our house. It's He's We have to travel to it by sea. This is such a beautiful place, Rob. Sitka. You want to go there and live there? Sure. Oh. Wow. Uh, look at that lighthouse up there, too. That's so lovely. That is your home? Who are you, people? <laughs> We're the Paxtons. That <laughs> <laughs> you. <laughs> Mom, what what is this? Nothing. Welcome home party? It's just a yeah. little welcoming party. Is that a crime? Just 50 of our closest friends and neighbors and all excited to meet you. Okay. Great. That sounds oh, horrible no. for her. What does a book editor do? Well, that's a great question, Louise. I'm curious to know the oh. answer myself. I know that guy. Who? Oh, Dad. Son? Dad. Uh -huh. I feel like I know him. Why don't you tell us exactly what a book editor does? I mean, besides taking writers out to lunch and getting bombed. Dude sounds like an ass. Not like in the dad so no. far. She's your meal ticket, and you brought her home to meet your mother. No, 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 no. She's not my meal ticket, Dad. She's my fiance. Getting married. Damn. Oh Drop the bomb. The texture, I'm not a I'm fish person. I like it. <laughs> You're very, very sweet. I, I think if you want. Just. <laughs> oh, ew. <laughs> just forced her to eat that. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh. oh. I'm so sorry. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he just told everybody. Maybe he doused her without her. Look at her. Right there, ladies and gentlemen. There she is. <laughs> there she is. There she is. Guys. That's her. Andrew, hi. Gert. Oh, my God. Gert. Hey, Gert. That's his ex. Yep. 
for sure. No, no, this is my, my ex, uh, Gertrude. Yeah. Gertrude. 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 Oh, wow, wow. You call me Gert. Well, um, congratulations, you guys. Gert. Thank you. Thank you. I bet you I know what Gert wants to do, Bryce. Flirt. Flirt. <laughs> oh. oh, how a man proposes says a lot about his character. He did it. I actually would love to hear this story, Andrew. Would you tell us? Oh, well. It's kind of a funny story. <laughs> Margaret loves telling the story, so I'm just going to her <laughs> He's so good at deflecting onto her. Probably been wanting to do it for three years. Andrew and I were about to celebrate our first anniversary together. And I knew that he'd been itching to ask me to marry him, and he was scared like a little tiny bird. I can't take it. I can't take it. Yeah, that's not exactly. <laughs> no? No. I mean, I, I picked up on all of her little hints. You know, this woman's about as subtle as a gun. <laughs> gun, gun! <laughs> that she might find this little box. Oh, I... the decoupage box that he made where he, he'd oh. taken... The... They're just, like, changing each other's stories. Yeah. I opened that beautiful little decoupage and out fluttered these tiny little hand-cut hearts and fetties. And once they cleared... Everyone's just... <laughs> it does sound real. Uh, Big, fat, nothing. There was nothing. No ring. No ring. What? I, I can't handle the story, bro. There was a little handwritten note mm. with the address to a hotel. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> like a mission. <laughs> Masculine. Mm. Yeah. 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 <laughs> nice. There he was. Standing. Kneeling like on a bed of rose petals in a tuxedo, your son. <laughs> this is such a weird story. Your son. I feel like it sounds pretty good, though, right? I fell and for it. Held back the tears and finally caught his breath. She's just trying to make him look super Marshall sensitive. And she said, "Yep." In the end. <laughs> <laughs> she said, "Yep." She said, "Yep." Let's cut this story. Hey, let's see a kiss oh, yeah. from you two yeah. cuties. What? Yeah. Who is yeah, this dude? That's weird, huh? This guy reminds me of the guy. Here we go. Let's go. Oh, dude. oh my god. Oh, <laughs> kiss her yeah. on the mouth. Yes, sir. Kiss her. Kiss her. Kiss her. Kiss her. Okay, okay. It's going to be such an awkward Yeah, kiss. it's going to be crazy. Oh. Oh my god. Oh, Gammy. What? How are you feeling if Gammy asked you to do this? Oh. Eyes are open, huh? Lips not moving. Oh. oh, hold up. Yo, pause. Something like kicked in there halfway through. Oh, Gammy. Yeah, they got something going. Oh, oh puppy dog. Did she say what is it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's Kevin. Look how cute Kevin is. Just be sure you don't let him outside, or the eagles will snatch him. I feel like she's gonna let him outside at some point. The eagles will snatch him. It has special powers. Oh, what kind, what? Of, what kind of special powers? I call it the baby maker. Okay, well. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't throw it on the bed. Oh, well, it's on the bed now. It's been quite an evening, so good night. The everybody. baby maker. Make some babies on that quilt. Doesn't yeah, look that's right. It doesn't. I don't think it turns night in Alaska for a certain part of the year. Yeah, you're thinking of Iceland, I think. No, no Alaska is like that. Well, no, I th I'm pretty sure. Isn't like Iceland just never turns night? Yeah, or some there's some Antarctica part. as well. But Alaska, it's like a, it's like a two or three month period, I think, where it, it never the sun never actually sets in Alaska. Could be wrong though, but it you know, definitely happens at some point. There's times where it's always. I think there's times when it's always night there too, though. Can we just go to sleep? How many nights till he's in here, Zuff? I think one now. Maybe. We'll see. There's going to be a big day tomorrow. Yeah, the sun would just be brutal yeah. to sleep in. Well, there's like blinds there, right? You can. Yeah, I don't know why she just doesn't close the blinds. Looks like I won't be getting much sleep with the sun streaming in. Yeah. If it had the remote in his hand. <laughs> Frank, Frank, darling, Frank, it's going to be fine. 
I can just call them and I can cancel. Dog's getting outside. Oh no. Yep. And oh, Kevin's outside. Hopefully, no eagle gets it. Oh, if an eagle gets it, I'm gonna be no, very no, sad. No, no. Hey, well, Frank, if I oh, oh no. good, good. I want the eagle to take her phone. Inspired me with your beautiful words, and and I feel that dog. I'm on the oh, phone. Oh no. Oh, the eagle is making its move. Oh, Frank, yeah, that's what's uh, happening. I just, uh, I just want you to be happy, Frank. Give me that dog. Uh, oh no. Frank, Frank, for you to hold on. Oh my God, the eagle has the dog. Oh my gosh. That's bad. That's no, no. Good, good, good catch. Oh, coming back, coming back for for this seconds. Your legacy, this book, and I think it's up to you to present your legacy. Oh God, take her phone. It's coming back. And my phone is on all the time. Okay, bye bye. No, wait. Got it. Uh, Got the phone. Good. No, no, no. Does not need that thing this no. weekend. <laughs> <laughs> Or what? I know. They think she's like being cute with it. Yeah. You have to get ready. What? Oh, you're going out with mom and the girls. I don't want to go shopping. out. Girls, not Sights. girls day. Surprise. I hate shopping. Oh, you love it. It's going to be great. I hate sightseeing. You're going. <laughs> you're going. I don't Hug want time. I don't want to. I don't want to. Oh, and, uh, there we go. <laughs> it's a nice hug, isn't it? Yeah. That's nice. There we go. Oh my gosh. Mm. Yeah. If you touch my ass one more time, I will cut your balls off in your sleep. All right, Ida. So, uh, we clear on that? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he likes touching your ass. I gotta set the rules there. I practically built an empire with your mother from the ground up. It doesn't mean anything. Unless, unless you have someone to leave it to. Yeah, we've already discussed this. Yeah, that. I'd like to discuss it again. I think I've been more than understanding about your goofing off in New York. Goofing off. He has a career. It must seem strange to you, my life in New York, sitting in an office, reading books. But it makes me happy. You understand? That's the most important thing, Andrew, is your happiness. His dad is stuck in his ways, bro. Mad at his son because he doesn't want to take over the family business. That'd be a cool business to take over, though. What is there? Isn't it just a bunch of business? I think it's just a lot, yeah. Like, they run the town. I hope you are ready for your big surprise because this is one of Sitka's greatest treasures. Sitka. What is it gonna be? Let's go to Sitka, guys. Sitka. Oh yeah. Oh. It's Oscar. <laughs> Relax. Don't do it. This is an oldie. They said, they said that this is one of the best shows that Sitka has to offer. Yeah. When you are gone. <laughs> this is like a 1900 song. Crazy to say it like that. Don't do it. That's Oscar. You know him from The Office? Never Rob? It's almost like the first thing I said when I saw him was, it's Oscar. <laughs> over here. Over here. Get over here. Betty White's getting down with it. Uh oh. She's got to go out there. Nope. Wouldn't want to go up there if I were her. <laughs> okay. Fuck <laughs> my eyes out. <laughs> Ramon. <laughs> Oh, oh my god, goodness, Ramon. This is not what I was expecting. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. I feel like you need to be a little tipsy for this dance, huh? Oh, what's he doing there? I hate this. What are those? I hate this. Are they some sort of side up? This has gone f too far. No, no, no. Oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Oh my god! Smack him! <laughs> Please don't. Please don't. Can I get down now? Dude, what the I've hell? I've never seen him like this. That is crazy. <laughs> what a surprise. The night before we graduated school, he proposed. Oh gosh. And said he wanted to elope and run away to New York with me. You said no. Damn. And I said no. She said oh. no. I can't even imagine proposing to someone and them saying no. That has to just be heartbreaking. Cheers to you guys. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. A lot of My air. empty cup. Oh no. 
Oh. Keep taking some anger out. It looks like nothing's all right. What is he? He's just smacking shit with tools? What did you do? I didn't do anything. I mean, I just had a, a frank conversation with him about his future. Ugh, that sounds like a nightmare. He is my son. I only get to see him every three years because of you. Oh. You are going to fix this, Joe. I mean it. Fix it now. For real, dude. It's a jackass. Mom was spitting f absolute facts. Uh-oh, he can't hear. Uh-oh. I feel disaster incoming. Let me just oh. get a towel. That Let me just get a towel. Kevin is a he's just full of mischief. He's just always up to something. Why is he always there following? He's her? barking at her all the time. Uh-oh. Look at the view. Oh, she's going to look at him and be like, wow, that is a man-built perfection. Huh. Huh? I like that. <laughs> You're just blowing the air dry the blow dryer at him? You like that? He probably does like that. Yeah. You do like that. You like it. Uh -oh. What is he doing? What? What is he doing? I'm They're so both, confused. Both butt naked. Oh, oh my god, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Why are you oh my god. <laughs> that was, They like <laughs> smacked together like a sandwich. Just, you know, just go. 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 Fine. Go take a shower. Fine. You stink. Tattoo, by the way. What? Oh. See? See? Exactly. Oh. You see that? Barely made it out with my life. <laughs> <laughs> Dog's terrifying. What's the deal with you and your father? Oh, I'm sorry. That question is not in the box. <laughs> it's not going to be on the test. No. I like the psychic network. Not in the ha-ha, isn't that funny? She likes that trash kind of way. I actually quite enjoy it. I took disco lessons in the sixth grade. Disco lessons. How does one learn disco? I don't like flowers in the house because they remind me of funerals. He's just running down the list of things that he needs to know or something. Yeah. I went to the bathroom and cried after Bob called me a poisonous bitch. Yeah, these are just like personal things that he probably doesn't even need. Yeah. <clears throat> There's swallows. I got them when I was 16. After my parents died. Oh. Still putting up to him. This is good. It takes two to make a thing go right. Oh, I do know that song. I do know that song. I know. What? Uh oh. I like this energy. Flirting. You are a very, very beautiful woman. Okay, okay. Putting it out there, huh? You got a big smile on her face. I'm not internationally known, but I'm not. He's singing that song. <laughs> what? Yeah. Why would she do to make a thing go around? <laughs> <laughs> it takes two to make a <laughs> Why does he what sound like that? <laughs> it takes two to make a Oh, oh no. <laughs> wow, oh, he the is chemistry. the Riz machine. Chemistry. The Riz Reaper, if you will. Oh, whoa. That looked nice. Who are we trying to impress? Kevin. Kevin. Room service. Breakfast. You're gonna have to eat that bowl. Andrew. 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 Mm. Andrew. <laughs> <laughs> Pop your doors off. Just a second. Don't act like you're sleeping on the floor. <laughs> 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 the baby maker. Are you wearing makeup? What? No, no. Of course not. <laughs> I'm sorry. More than wooden. Your family now. It's not trouble. Hey, you have room for one more? <laughs> what do you want? Hey, let's hit golf balls that dissolve in the lake. We want you to get married here tomorrow. What? 
<laughs> we want you to get married tomorrow. I want you to get married here, where we can be all together, and that way Grandma Annie can be a part of it. Oh, oh. <laughs> no, no, no. It would be a dream come true for me to see my one grandchild's wedding. A dream come true. So you'll do it? Oh, you can't say no to Gammy. <laughs> He's going. Before mm -hmm. I'm dead? Oh, oh. Okay, okay. oh, that line hits different. R.I.P. Betty. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's sad. Oh, my. Oh, I've always wanted to get married in a in a barn. I have. <laughs> <laughs> I have. I've actually been to a wedding in a barn, and it was very, very nice. I have, too. Barn venues can be I, very I nice. I went to one, too, with Grace. Yeah, Zeph was there with me, actually. Didn't feel like we were in a barn, though. No. Yeah, they're usually really nice barns. Yeah. It's not like we we're, we're going to be married forever. Happily divorced before you know it. It'll be fine. That robbing. Oh, oh my Whoa, god. Whoa, we're actually getting pretty close here. Whoa. Oh. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> it comes, it's just, it's so natural now. What in the. Oh, my bike now. Okay, you just. You just have to focus, Margaret. If she gets like attacked, there's a bunch of bears there, aren't there? Alaska's known for bears, aren't they? I have no clue. Bears and cabins. Apparently, they have eagles. I can do this. That was oh my gosh. gosh. That was a different I, kind oh of God. eagle. He's going off God, I trail. Where is she just doesn't, going? Doesn't look like the outfit to enjoy a bike ride in the woods. What? Is there a band? What if it's freaking. Ramon playing a flute randomly in the woods. What is that? Is that Gammy? I think so. <laughs> what is she doing, bro? Margaret of New York. It is I, Grandma Annie. <laughs> <laughs> Come, see how I give thanks to Mother Earth. What is this? It's some kind of ritual. Dance with me and celebrate. Oh God! You know, can I can I just uh, thank her from here? I'll just. I insist. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> fire! Follow and learn. Where'd the fire go? E ya. E ya. E ya. E e ya. Shen. Yes. To the universe. The universe. Ah, ah. Universe. Yes, we're doing a tribal Oh, she's going crazy chant in the woods. She's going crazy. To the window. To the, the window. Wall. To the walls. To the walls. To the sweat drips. Down my, my balls. balls. <laughs> oh, you bitches. Crawl. Oh, you see. Mother. Oh, you see. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is the best <laughs> chant. Oh, you bitches. Crawl. Oh, you see. Mother. Dude, how confused. Oh, you see. <laughs> 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 Look at her. <laughs> He's kind of feeling it, I feel. Oh my god. Let me see you again, though. You scared, you scared. Okay. You scared, you scared. You scared. What you doing? Just shaking my ass with your grandma, you know. We're giving thanks to the universe. Mother nature. You're a freak. Shut up. <laughs> that was so weird. Ow. Yo, I like them together. Am I falling in love with Is this what love is? With who? <laughs> is this what love is? Wait, which one are you falling in love with? I think Margaret. I feel like every I say this every time we watch a romance. You do. <laughs> you do. Hi. Remember this? <laughs> How can yes. I forget? Yeah. Remember it. Wonderful. She's backing up. Yes. Remember that? Yes. Yes. Do it. Yeah, I know. No, you wanna go. <laughs> <laughs> He's been awesome in this, Rob. He's been awesome in this. He has been. <laughs> Gert. When it runs Who's out, that? Gives you a warning. Just put in more dimes. You're kidding. Dimes? You're not kidding? Gert, the teacher. Uh-oh. I think a little jealousy is about to come in, Zuff. Somebody's about yeah, to get jealous? I think she's going to get jealous. What is she trying to do here? Use the internet. There you go. Okay. <clears throat> now. Oh. What is that? What is that? Dial up. You know if you know. I know. I heard it. 
Uh oh. Oh, he's out there chopping it up with the X. That probably doesn't feel too good. Right, we're gonna have to steal you away, young lady. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm just gonna. No, not to worry. No strippers. No chatting in the woods. Promise. Oh, what? Well, yeah. What are we probably picking a dress out, right? Are they getting married today? This woman is just not allowed to work at all. Is today the wedding day? No, tomorrow is when they wanted. Oh, to yeah, be. yeah. Yeah, and don't worry about the fit because Annie is the best tailor in Southeast Alaska. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh, I like that a lot. Definitely does not fit. Definitely does not fit. Oh, let's see if we can find your boobs. <laughs> They're in there somewhere. Yes, they are. <laughs> this is like an Easter egg. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I feel like it's, it can't be that hard to find them, huh? Maybe we could head down your way for the holidays. This year. So maybe we could we could come to you too. You overheard the conversation the other day. I like that very much. Oh. Grace, for God's sake, we've got work to do. <laughs> <laughs> she just wants to spend more time with her son. She never gets to see him. Even the, she's gonna let him go, even if they're not together too. It's been in the family for more than a hundred and fifty oh. years. That is an heirloom, if I've ever seen one. You can't give it. She can't. Plan on divorcing him with this. Well, I mean, she's not gonna. They're meant for each other. I know, but the thought makes me sad. Grandmothers love to give their stuff to their grandchildren. It makes us feel like we'll still be part of your lives even after we're gone. Oh. Take it. She feels like she can't take it because this is all like a, a sham, not a real marriage. You're gonna be beautiful. <laughs> Now let's get you out of those pins. Oh gosh. Gammy. I love Gammy. I love Betty White. Ugh, oh, it breaks my heart. Come on in. Uh, He's man in the ship. <laughs> Yo, whoa. She's on a mission right now. Margaret! I forgot, okay? You forgot what? I forgot what it was like to have a family. Oh. I forgot what it felt like to have people love you and make you breakfast and, and say, hey, we'd love to come down for the holidays. And I said, well, why don't we come up and see you instead? Your family loves you. You know it's that. Maybe, you know that. Yeah. Chill on the boat. What? Oh, chill on the boat. What is your mother you you know my daughter oh, oh, no, 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 we're not driving anymore. Why is this happening on this oh. boat? Oh! oh no! <laughs> she can't swim. She can't swim. She remember? She can't swim. Oh shit! Oh! He's gonna save her. This is gonna be romantic. Oh! It's okay. I feel really bad for her, dude. That's the reason she's like that. Yeah. There's not anyone that loves her. All of her family members have been dead since she was 16. He's being good. He is good. I want to talk to both of you. I've been a dick this whole movie. Told you I'd check up on you. It's not oh, something sweet. It's not no, something sweet. It is not. Here's your statement. I've been working for Margaret Tate for three years. Six months ago, we started dating. We fell in love. I asked her to marry me. She said yes. I'll see you at the wedding. Told the family they had a one-year anniversary. No, they said our first anniversary. Didn't say one year. True. First anniversary. Dude, wow. Dad sucks. Yeah. Sucks. The mom is way too sweet for that turd. Ah. Uh. She's not gonna show. Or is she? She's here. There's gonna be a scene though, bro. I feel like it's gonna be emotional. I'm prepared. Oh, it's so sad that she has to walk by herself, Loki. I hope Gammy joins her. Yes! Uh huh, how'd you know? That's awesome. She looks gorgeous. 
I feel like we're that watching fuckers Br here? Bridgerton. I think just because of her dress, you're saying. No, I am because of like the fake him. Oh, no this guy has way. every job in town. Uh, he is everything. Dude. He's awesome. He's gonna do some weird shit. We are gathered here today <laughs> to give thanks, for it is their family and friends who taught Andrew and Margaret to love. So it is only right. Oh no, this is gonna be bad, Bryce. Yeah, oh gosh, we already know. I do have something I need to say. Oh. Can't wait till after. Oh, don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop thinking about it. I forced Andrew here to marry me. Margaret, stop it. See, Andrew has always had this extraordinary work ethic. Something I think he learned from you. How do you feel right now, dude? So I blackmailed him to come up here and to lie to you. <gasps> All of you. Dude. She's making herself just look like the villain, which in the beginning kind of was. Turns out it's not easy to ruin someone's life once you find out how wonderful they are. Oh. Oh, Gammy, Gammy. Don't look at me like that. Andrew, this was a business deal and you held up your end, but now the deal is off. No. Sorry. Oh, while she's wearing well, I mean, the dress gonna, and the it's necklace. Gonna, it's going to be good. It's going to be a good ending. Oh, that has to be crushing for his family. Yeah, she's gone. She left everything back. Is that his uh, <clears throat> manuscript? Manuscript. Well, Eric, get out of here. You know, people are going to be talking about this forever. Okay. <laughs> Why are you here? Are you okay? Yeah. No. No. <laughs> no. No, I'm not. You're just going to let her go? Go get your woman. Is it go a, is get it a, her, Andrew. Is it a running through the airport type of love? Yeah, I think so. I have the smallest airport at Sitka, but the Sitka Airlines. Andrew, Andrew, what's I gotta happening? talk to her. Why would you Boy. do that? This has nothing to do with Boy, you. Uh oh. Stop. Uh oh. He just asked. I mean it. I'm not asking your permission here. Ah. Oh no. Oh. Shut the hell up. Come on. Ah. Oh. Somebody get a doctor. Easy. Oh my God, she's getting life flighted. Get her in there. It's so hard to see that happen to Betty White. I know. Promise me you'll stand by Andrew, even if, if you don't agree with it. I promise. Can't say no to Betty White, bro. The game is actually impossible. The spirits can take me. No. Annie. Yeah, put that mask back on, Annie. You're being dramatic. I guess they're not ready for me. <laughs> yeah. I'm feeling much better, Sonny. No need to take us to the hospital. Oh, God. Was she oh. faking it? Ma'am, you know we're not authorized to take you to the airport. Larry Ferris, don't make me call your mother. <laughs> you got it. You got it. <laughs> got it you got it, Gammy. <laughs> Larry Ferris? Go, 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 go. It's not run through the airport type love. It's running through the... What's the thing called? The airplane. The catwalk. No, not catwalk. Runway. Runway type of love. Okay, I have a little favor I need from you, buddy. Uh, Margaret's on that plane. I gotta talk to her. Can you stop it? Oh, yeah. What about your lady, babe? This is this guy. The one who's like, yeah. give her a kiss. Oh. Yeah. Stop the plane, please. I can't do that. <laughs> He's gonna get in the middle of the... No, 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 come on! Oh, no. Oh, no. That's not the plane. The plane. That's the wrong one. Get on the plane. I'm sorry, son. I, I didn't know how you felt about it. I just, I didn't you, either. I thought that you didn't like her, so I was just gonna ruin your marriage. No one's helping her. No, she did not have any friends in this office. What? What? Oh. <sighs> hey. hey. <laughs> Haven't seen you since. Left me at the altar. 
Make a scene, please. Why, why are you panting? Because I've been running. <laughs> <laughs> I need to talk to you. Yeah, well, I don't have time to talk. I need to catch a 545 to Toronto. Margaret. So I need the boxes to go out today. I want to make sure everything is... Margaret, to... stop talking! Damn. Oh. You can imagine my disappointment when it suddenly dawned on me that the woman I love is about to be kicked Ooh. out. The oh, yeah, he dropped the word. He the said the word. So, Margaret, marry me. Because I'd like to date you. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? What? I think it would just be a lot easier. He's gonna kiss her. We forgot everything that happened, and I just left. Sometimes you don't have to take the easy way. You have to take the hard way. I'm scared. Oh. Oh. Mm. Yeah. Every kiss begins with kiss. Adorable. Injected into my veins, Ryan Reynolds and Sandra Bullock. That's a very good couple. couple I didn't They're know dating I in real life. Made that one up right now, huh? Are you supposed to get down on your knee or something? I'm going to take that as a yes. <laughs> Marry me, because I would like to date you. Yeah, so you talk, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you two are engaged again. For real, one wrong answer, I'm going to take you down. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I think Let's they can it. pass. All right, The Proposal. That was a very, very good movie. I liked that movie a lot. It was really it was good. Very, very cute. I remember really liking it when I was a kid, and I remember why. I feel like the on-screen chemistry for Ryan Reynolds and... Uh, Sandra Bullock is very real. I, I I want them to be a couple in real life. Though. No, he's happily married. Yeah, I, I get that. But who's he married these, to? Like Lively. Like Lively. Uh, these characters are super cool. I really really like the two main characters. Such a unique story too. I don't know. It re it really does hold up. I think this movie is what like twelve or thirteen years old at this point. Uh -oh, I think probably turns fourteen this year actually. Yeah. So yeah, I mean, I also very much enjoyed this movie another good rom-com and it's just it's so i just i don't know i always you always catch me saying the same things in the romantic movies and shows we watch i just i want it to be me next when will it be me you guys can tell me when it's gonna be me because i don't know wow this turned really sad <laughs> no all fun and games all fun and games but no really no no games <laughs> but <laughs> what are we saying right now <laughs> I I was I loved Ryan Reynolds and Sandra Bullock in this. I loved freaking Oscar in this too. His real name's Oscar. I think he's, I forget his last name. I think it's Nunes. Nunes. Yeah, something like that. Also from The Office. Very different character in this than if you ever watched The Office and seen him in that. He was hilarious. Betty White, rest in peace. She oh was my Betty White killed this yeah. movie. She was awesome in this. So good. She was so funny. Really broke my heart. A lot of her scenes were like... Yeah, she had so many lines where I was just like, ugh. Don't say that, Betty. Don't say that. Yeah, she had a lot of lines that referenced like her dying or like her not getting to see something happen. Like, I don't know. It was yeah. sad watching this today and like knowing how... She passed away not too recently or yeah. not too long ago. It just sucks. But I mean, she was super, super awesome. And it's and I'm glad I'm glad that we have movies like this where we get to like watch and be like, damn, Betty White was she's hilarious. Yeah, she was so awesome. Funny. I've never probably, watched the Golden Girls, but yeah, probably every movie I've seen her. She's just so, so funny. Timeless. The dad, this movie. I feel like there's a lot of movies where there's an asshole parent. You gotta have a villain. There's gotta be an antagonist. The dad was definitely that guy. He, him and like the Gilbertson. Oh, Gilbertson. Gilbertson yeah. I like, I dislike Gilbertson a little bit more, I think. When so he, I to know. be honest, he was just doing his job. Gilbertson, yeah, he was just doing his job. Granted, like he was taking it very, very seriously yeah. and going out of his way, but like, the I dad guess, was just a bad dad and like dad, a shitty dude. Like he'd I don't call know. Gilbertson up to last. Yeah, yeah to ruin pretty, his son's wedding. Like it's pretty. Come up. on, bro. Even if you know it's fake, like what are you doing? Like just watching Gilbertson there laugh, like laugh when he knew he was right yeah. during the wedding. Like that Trigger little weasel sure. ass. He needed hit. <laughs> he was a little weasel <laughs> ass. <laughs> he needed hit. <laughs> I think yeah, this is definitely our first. Sandra Bullock and Ryan Reynolds appearances on the channel but like I said I have seen Sandra Bullock and other things and like 
I feel like she like always plays kind of like a similar character to this. Like like they said in the movie, she's like a tough, tough woman. And yeah, I just really like when she like plays characters like that. I feel like she like absolutely can nail like the the boss role like that. Super like intimidating and like, she had me sad as hell in that one scene know, talking lo- about how she hasn't had a family since she was sixteen, know, dude. Man. That was like making me actually sad. And she fell into the water. Yeah, and they're just going a hundred miles per hour on a boat at the same time. It's just like chaotic. Mm-hmm. Also looked like she could swim. She could float for sure. She swam. She was floating. I don't think like I've watched honestly too many movies that have taken place in Alaska either. It's like a random thing, but like just a beautiful place. Yeah. Like I'd like to go there someday after it's watching very, this. Very beautiful. You ever, uh, you've never seen 28 Days Later? No. You've mm-hmm. never seen The Revenant? No. Well, that's cool though that like I'm sure he's still going to get his manuscript published or sold or whatever you want to call it. And that's going to be cool because like that's that's been his dream. Like he had to kind of like... I feel bad for him too, to be honest. Like, yeah, he like grew up rich and stuff, but like, obviously his dad was a bit of a dick and like he got rejected by the girl he was dating for so long. Like she wouldn't move with him. They didn't really respect his career or like what he was trying to pursue. It it definitely shows that like people have different problems. Like just because someone's problems aren't the same as yours doesn't take away from the fact that they have their own things going on in their own lives. Like everybody's got stuff going on. He had issues with his family and she didn't have a family and like i don't know you can definitely see both sides of the struggle there mom or the mom and gammy though were definitely accepting of mostly everything it felt like oh yeah and it was sad seeing the mom just not like get to see andrew ever and they like i feel like they're gonna see him a lot more now that that trip happened which is good yeah they should just move back to sitka and just run the Maybe not that no. business, but like open up their own thing. Cause that town is so cute and cool. A very cool town. And the family's awesome. Like just imagine staying there all the time. Like oh. they gotta do their thing though. They got whole ass careers going on. You can't have a successful publishing company in Sitka. Sorry. Paxton Publishing Company. Mm-hmm. It has a well, good you got a writer ring, like freaking Andrew. Paxton Publishing. I don't think he's a writer. I think he's an editor, I guess. Yeah, yeah. he just like found the book like his manuscript was like a book that he wanted the publishing company to purchase and like publish so mm-hmm. he's still gonna check for that though true it, it definitely uh the first like 15 minutes of this movie like we said it, it did have devil wears prada vibes yeah it felt very time. similar and then it turned yeah, into it's not a devil it's, wears prada. as soon as they got to alaska it was like all of that similarity kind of went out the window yeah the Alaska was definitely the best part of the movie. Low key though, like we did say, this was the first Ryan Reynolds and Sandra Bullock movie that we've done for either of those actors on this channel. I would not be mad if we did more. I really liked both of them. I haven't seen a movie with either of them in, in a while and would not complain if you guys recommended recommend some more of their movies. Recommend them. Or Betty White too. Or more Betty White Maybe movies. Maybe we'll do heck the heck yeah. Or Oscar girls. Nunez too. If you guys do like our videos, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Check out our links in the description. The first one is going to be the Patreon. We do all of our uncut videos over there as well as some early access. Second is going to be the Discord. Come talk to us about the proposal. It was a great movie. Would love to talk to you about it over there. And lastly, follow our social medias, our Instagrams and Twitters, and send us some stuff to the address at the very bottom of the description. That is our PO box. We do mail time on the channel, so check that out. And yeah, we'll catch you guys next week for movie night number 50. Can't wait for that. CNN.